Hi, Dan Trix here, doing tricks for you to make your worlds a little bit more magical. Before we start, I'd just like to thank my middle finger for uh, sticking up for me whenever I needed it to. I hope you guys are well. Now I have bought a couple of books recently. One, The 13 Steps to Mentalism. I've been learning the card tricks in this book. <gasps> card tricks, I hear you say. Mentalism. <laughs> well, some of these effects in here are actually quite nice and hopefully in the near future, you'll see some of the card tricks you can learn from this book. If you've got the book, let me know what you think. I'm going to London with my good friend Duncan. If you haven't seen the other video, check it out. I also bought this book a little while ago, Rune's World, The Magic of Rune Can, by Joshua J. If you've ever seen this book or even read it, let me know what you think. I haven't learned anything from it yet. Well illustrated, as you can see. There are some nice little gags and things in here, which I'm sure I could use. Soul of the Zombie, where you make a cloth float. All of a sudden you pull the cloth away and it's your shoe and you're stood there with no shoe on. <laughs> Today's effect is from Making the Cut by Ryan Sklutz. This is quite a nice book actually. It's got some really, really cool effects in it. And the one I'm doing today is called When in Doubt, Palm Read. And it's on page 21. It's an effect where you supposedly read the spectator's palm. Check it out, I hope you enjoy it. Let me know what you think. See you after. Now, I'll do a bit of palm reading, okay? Now, would you just uh, put your hand up for me? Just bring your hand over here. Now, look at this. I'm not, I've only just started doing palm reading, but uh, it's the light, I can't really see. Got all the lines on your hand there, and um, I can't see because of the light, I think. Uh, <laughs> it's the wrong hand, wrong hand. Okay, so we're, yeah, I'll tell you what, I think so. Sorry, it's the wrong hand, wrong hand. So roll that one up, okay. So now, let's have a look. There's the Mercury line down here. Now, what matters is your lifeline, which is here, and it should go all the way, oh, um, yeah, don't worry about that. Okay, so now what about the heart line? That heart line's a good one. That should be big and bold. And go, uh. Okay, it doesn't matter, I'll tell you what. We've got the lifeline, which is here, which should go always above. Oh. Okay, it doesn't matter. So, what we're gonna do, we've got the heart line, which should be big and bold, which... Anyway, I'll tell you what we're gonna do. Let's forget about that. Okay, so actually what I do is, is, a, is a card trick. I'm better at card tricks, to be honest with you. you help me out. Okay. Now, would you just do me a big, big favour? The, all these cards are different. Now, I just want you to point to any card you want. Now, they're all, they're all different. Okay. Yeah. I want you to point to any card you wish. Oh, that's it, there. I want you just to look at it. Have you got it? You look at it, just point to one. This one right here. Now, all I want you to do is I want you to look at that card. Just look at it. You got it? Yeah? Remember the card? Can you remember it? Yeah? Did you see the card? You didn't see the card. Okay, that's good. I did. Yeah, okay. Well, you didn't see it. Now, I want you to... What's your name? Ryan. Emma. Look at... What's your name again, sorry? <laughs> Laura. I want you to look at Emma. And in your mind, say the card. Only in your mind, not out loud. Anna. Brian. Okay, Brian. You're just going to look at Brian. I want you to just, in your mind, say the card. In your mind. <laughs> look at Brian. In your mind, say the card. But not out loud. Any time you like. Just call out stop. There? Yeah. Now I'm going to place this card down here, like so. Put both your hands out like that for me, as if you're begging. Obviously you're not. Now, any time Brian, just call out stop. Yeah? Now look, Brian, put this card down here, right? Name your card. The six of spades. To see how well we're trying to read that Nora, isn't it? Now look. The six of spades. What was your card? The two of hearts. Now, Brian, see how well you've done. You stopped me there. Would you just turn that over for me? It isn't a fact. <laughs> now, you, you two know each other very well, but if you've heard the same, you've heard the saying, I know you like the back of your hand. Yeah. Like the back of my hand. Yeah. Well, look, over here, the whole time is in fact. <laughs> you must know each other quite well. But I'll tell you what, you know the saying, I know you like the back of my hand. Well, look, check this out. I know you like the back of my hand because look, over here, we've got six of spades. 
Well, I can make some on because you're going to fake now. So there you have it. When in doubt, palm read by Ryan Scott making the cut. So please let me know what you think. I hope you enjoyed that little effect. So yeah, remember, subscribe, press the bell, smash the like button. See you next time. You can't just bother this. Yeah. I can. I can. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, so we're gonna. What's your name? That was my name. Look, oh, Annabelle, I'll tell you what. I'll take this, Annabelle. Let's put your hand out. In your hand is nothing. Have you ever had nothing in your hand? I'll take it. Look, nothing here, nothing there. Nothing. Watch. Nothing. Throw it in the air, catch it, watch nothing. Become something. In this case, it's an American half dollar. Check it out, it's real. See it going. Disappears. Find her ear. In fact, sorry, that's over here behind yours. Right here. But what's the coin inside the hand? You have a shape and it goes up the hand. I go like that, hand empty, I rub, and it goes through the hand. Put your hand up. Watch that coin. One, two, straight through the hand. So, would you just would you hold her flowers for her? Just put both your hands up like that for me. Put that hand on top of that hand for me. Now watch carefully. I'm going to take this coin. One, two, and it vanishes. It travels around your hand. Have a look inside. He's not in there. Have a look. Oh no, it got stuck on her shoulder. Can you see it? Just there. Oh my god! But look, if I take this coin from here, place it in the hand, give it a little rub, a little wave, it vanishes. It comes back, watch that coin disappear and end up inside my hat. In fact, sorry, it ends up over there behind my knee. But can you see, watch the coin go in the hat and the drink. Yeah, the alcohol comes out of this. Yeah, yeah, yeah.